Hi folks, I'm Andre Morgana and I'm excited about a new project that I have called Mount Shasta Spiritual. And right now it's a Facebook group and it could become a, uh, a Zoom group as well. And it's a private group because it's about spiritual experiences that are people are having while they're living here in Mount Shasta or visitors to the area. And what I've observed over the years, I've only been here since 2008, but everybody is having different experiences. It's not like one big group and they're constantly meeting and it's all about this. But this person's experiencing one thing, that one's experiencing another thing, this one's experiencing uh, the soul and self-discovery, this one's experiencing um, the spirituality of world traditions, this one's exploring consciousness and science, um, and even, you know, uh, alternative health and wellness, people are exploring the spirituality of it. Our environment, people are exploring, exploring the uh, spirituality of it. Nature speaks. Um, a lot of things going on in that area. And of course, because this is Mount Shasta, uh, we have the indigenous culture here. And they have a lot to offer in terms of healing. And it's not just the medicines they offer, but it's the stories behind it. Why this medicine? Why that? Uh, and so this is a group, a private group, where people can uh, add in their uh, posts about uh, what they're exploring, what they're interested in. Uh, this is a big area for the Ascended Masters um, and uh, people who uh, feel connected to star systems, planets, uh, a lot of uh, civilizations within our uh, universe. It's just a wide variety going on here and the sincerity and the depth and the uh, commitment is very solid here. I think it's the future of science. Now it'll take science a while to come around to it, although there are scientists in the Bay Area that are pursuing, you know, what is the scientific explanation of channeling, for instance. But it's something that, um, I'll tell you how it's scientific already. One person's having an experience and then somebody else from some other part of the world is saying they're having that experience. They're having an experience also and it's the same experience. So how, how do you come up with that? And it's not that they both went to a class and they learned what the class had to offer. They're having these experiences on their own. So I think this, I'm really excited about this. The people that have come forward and, and have joined up so far, uh, it's just going to be really, really interesting, interesting uh, to see what people write about. They can write about their experiences, what they're exploring. They can uh, write about events they're having. Um, you know, the, it's, it's, it's wide open, but it is private so that uh, people feel uh, protected in talking about things that are very personal to them. And... Um, uh, having a support of a group that doesn't bash them for their experiences and uh, there's no politics involved. I even said there's no COVID involved unless someone's having a spiritual experience about COVID because I just don't want to get into that um, realm of um, so much uh, disruption right now with opinions. This is just one particular subject, the, uh, the inner experiences that people are having about who they are uh, and what their experiences are that are helping them in their spiritual growth, helping them in their uh, life and their stability of their life. If you're interested, uh, the way to sign up, be, uh, because you have to invite somebody when it's an, uh, I'm new to Facebook group, so this is something I'm just learning. You have to invite somebody if they're interested. And then they give you a, a list of a fan group, and I couldn't find anybody on that that I knew that would be interested, so I'm just creating my own list. And, but just putting out the word, a lot of people have responded. And uh, once that gets organized, then we'll go ahead and start a hit. So what you do is, um, on Facebook, you go to my Facebook page, Andre Morgana, and just send me a message, or you can email me at the best of Mount Shasta, MT Shasta, at gmail.com. So those are the two ways to get a hold of me, and from there we'll uh, go forward with it. But I'm really excited about it. I hope you are as well, and uh, let me know if you want to be involved. Thanks so much.